hello everybody, welcome to game number 15 of Unflappable. Uh, I'm unfortunately flapping before we start the match because just real life getting me down, so this is probably not going to be as successful as the previous outings. But there you go, uh, we've got Fanjo 730. I will fucking drop kick, Jesus. He's got an eye blow, he's got a bear. He's got a bear. They've got nothing to the team. The team is rubbish, really. It's not surprising the record's bad. I mean, high elves are a bit rubbish, right? But I shall stick in and try my hardest. And hopefully it won't be a misery guts. But I mean, it's hard when you are miserable in real life, isn't it? To not be miserable on stream. But I shall try. I shall try my best <laughs> to battle through the abject misery. Maybe I should just stream Minecraft and... Maybe I should just stream Minecraft and... Uh, Storybook Brawl for two weeks. But then it would be quite good to... I, like, I have been enjoying the Blue Ball. I have been unflappable. I have been unflappable, to be fair. It's just, you know, all the stuff with, with JFW and Five Idiots and there's other things as well for me. I'm just kind of down. Down in real life and down on the internet as well, so it's... It's all a bit crap. That is the problem. So... Thanks, Dio. Oh, I don't, do I want to Dakar against Kisler? I feel like I just want to beat them up because they're shit. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Thank you very much, sorry. I got it. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will I'm defend. I'm not just trying to get sad I will bits. Defend. Don't worry. Glorious. No, I won't give oh, in. Wow, this sounds like Until a lot. I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Man, I'm just Until sad. I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Thank you very much, Ordon. And thanks for everybody with... Redeeming glorious. the eye like Jimmy Fantastic. No, Thank you very much, Jordan. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Don't be sad, Elliot. Err, uh, Jimmy. <laughs> sad Yod. Go here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So this is the kind of area that we have to defend. We basically don't even need to move. Nice. 
I don't really want him to get wrecked. Here on the bear was beautiful, wasn't it? Oh, Benny Bartos. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it, talking about good mo movies and bad movies? Because, no vanity. <laughs> it's funny talking about good movies and bad movies, because they literally only exist to make money, so therefore, if a movie makes money, it's a good movie. And if it doesn't, it's a bad movie. And that's all it is, isn't it? That's the only way you can judge it. If that seems random, it's because it's what people were talking about in the Discord. This is probably going overboard, right? Defending the ball too much. Um, But you know, it's it look it's symmetrical. Ça cherche clairement le corps à corps. Yeah, they used to be line warriors, didn't they, when they originally made? Ninety ninety four rules edition, they were called line warriors, and blitzers were dragon warriors. Bulls with the days. And the throws of Phoenix Warriors. I mean, white lines being catches, I guess it makes sense that they're strength three, but it doesn't really make sense that they're catches, does it? If anything like the white lines would be blockers. They are the, they are the hardest elves. Right, how many blitzers has he got? Has he got three? You gotta know which ones have got diamond tackle. Yeah, they're, they're, they're the hardest though, aren't they? The, the White Lions were strength four, they were like the, the hardest, the hardest fellas in the, uh, in the thing. The funny thing is, gutter, gutter runners were bloody strength four, um, in, in Warhammer, which are, uh, you know, imagine that. Imagine if gutter runners were just like nine four four seven. That would be more true to the uh, to the fluff of Warhammer. <laughs> Should be pretty fucking ridiculous. Hey, hey. 
Were they red hair? I'm not sure I ever used them, to be honest. I just had Sisters of Avalon. Millions of Sisters of Avalon. And then some dragons. I didn't really enjoy Total Warhammer. To be honest, it's just not my thing. It's just too frantic. It's just a frantic clicking game. I, I don't know. For me, I would want a game where, like, you're in charge of an army to be, like, tactical, you know? And it's not. It's just spamming clicks, you know? Like, that. it's just not what I want from it. It's just literally frantic clicking. That's all it is. Uh, I mean, kind of, someone else. They did have it, but it was just this bullshit um, idiot thing that they had in the uh, extra rules. Voilà un joueur qui est bon pour rester sur la touche un bout de temps. I was going to dodge through there and I can just walk around. And just make a GFI. Oh. Well, I have done goofed. Should not have stood him up. Because I couldn't dodge, because then he, he, he would diving tackle and jump up block. And now he can chain, right? So the only thing I can do is put the guard in there to make things difficult. And like, and when it comes to battles, right, the strategy is just literally like I don't know. I don't understand people who who want close combat armies because then the strategy is just fucking run in and and that's it. Like it's just boring and just mash into things. It's like fucking brain dead. It's really shooting and there's like there's a bit of strategy. I don't know. It's just I just didn't enjoy Total Warhammer at all. No, yeah, not everyone has to like the same, of course. But like you know that that's a, it's a popular genre, right? It's just for me. Like I can see it working more with like StarCraft and stuff, the frantic clicking, but I just wish that Total War wasn't a frantic clicking game. Because for me a frantic clicking game is not what I want. <laughs> See if you get the power here. I mean, I've got a palm anyway, so I might as well go in. Okay, we definitely powered him.
Need to occupy the glitter, I guess. That was a pretty good turn, wasn't it? Yeah, I wasn't saying it was bad, was it? I wasn't saying Total War was bad. I'm just saying the kind of game it is, which is a popular kind of game, is not a game that I like. Which is a shame because I like I don't know how you'd make it a game. I guess make it like turn based or whatever, right? Or something. Just make it like slower so it's like things develop and you like you know, use your brain a little bit to think what you know how you could counter things, you know, like you like Battle Brothers, right? Battle Brothers is like pretty good for like a more time. Like if um yeah, I quite like civilization, yeah. Because again the battles in like that's just a strategical thing, isn't it? There's no there's no tactics in the battles, you just you just make a big fucking stack. Yeah, so like Battle Brothers does a really good thing of like if more time was a video game, it would be Battle Brothers, right? It'd be brilliant. It'd be brilliant. If they if they made a more time video game that was Battle Brothers, that would be that would be fantastic. And uh so I guess something like that. Something like Battle Brothers for Warhammer would be pretty good. For me. Oh yeah, they did, yeah, they did, yeah. I even know that, I've played a bit, but still, it's pretty... It's still pretty basic, isn't it? Not... Like, the battles aren't as good as I'd like the battles to be. <laughs> Oh, nice. <sighs> okay, so he can dodge away. Everybody can dodge at the moment. He has to blitz him. Just because the, this guard can now come through very far forward. Do I want him? I guess so. <laughs> Glorious. Apple fail. Wow. Dice Lording is strong with this one. I mean, the, the you know, people say about the real-time Blood Bowl, but of course they could just make it like Blitz the League or whatever, you know, that video game. And it would be good, wouldn't it? <laughs> so what's the much fun to give you another upload? <laughs> yeah, I, I'll let this guy get served. Maybe I shouldn't have. But you know, you know, like it's just, it's just stupid. I, like, like, I really hate that argument of like saying how rubbish it was. Because yeah, I think it would be fine. Ham brawls. Yeah, XCOM. Yeah. 
Yeah, he's not very good at getting all of his players killed, is he? I mean, he's, well, sorry, he's, he's good at getting all of his players killed. Haha. <laughs> I sucked giving up this hit, didn't I? But I didn't want him to come for my balls. Three dice. Take note, chalice competitors. <laughs> Do I re-roll into trip skulls? It'd be funny, wouldn't it? Just risking another foul game. It'd be sick. It would genuinely be sick. You know the backbreaker. If you if you know if you know if you know NFL games, backbreaker. I never played it, but um, yeah, that's just a shit game, though, right? J5. Like backbreaker was pretty cool. It was a pretty cool concept in that they had um, they had like an actual physics engine for all the hits and that. So like, rather than like with Madden, it's just it's just. Uh, like canned animations every time anyone gets c tackled or whatever. Um, whereas in in Backbreaker, it's all like you know, it's a proper physics engine. So it depends like how fast people are running and everything in the angle, and it all just like you know, it all just like actually makes sense. But no one played it because no one gives a fuck because they want to play the NFL. They don't want to play, you know. Games of, you know, they don't they don't want the Atlanta Birds versus the <laughs> the Philadelphia the Philadelphia Big Birds, do they? Do you know what I mean? Like they just don't give a shit about it. They, they, they don't want they don't want to see Robbie Robbie Gonk and <laughs> and Tim Bordy. You know what I mean? They don't want all that. They want the license. Like that's what everyone wants. So so it, it totally flopped. But if if they had if they had got if they had got uh, if they'd done backbreaker and like made it orcs and fucking shit, it would have been amazing. Greatest of all, Tim. Yeah. I'll ask you all. J'aurais peut-être quelque chose de profond à dire quand les joueurs se. Tim Bordy, the greatest of all Tim. <laughs> I really wanted to go to Wimbledon. <laughs> just, <laughs> just to shout, come on, Tim. <laughs> when Murray was playing. <laughs> I really wanted to do that. <clears throat> And I know they're all just dickheads, but it fucking, it cracked me up. It cracked me up so much, I really wanted to do it. <laughs> yeah, no, but it's just, it's just the way people are, though, isn't it, JFI? It's just the way people are. It is what it is. Amazing that there was what was a furtive who was the unseen walker? It was like furtive stalker or something, wasn't it? It was unbelievable and unseen walker. Mm. <laughs> Come on, Tim. Yeah, the logo maker, Bezel's Bezel's logo making abilities were incredible. <laughs> the Boston half crabs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's just the license, and then obviously you get to do, release the same game every year, and then and then some genius thought of uh, some genius thought of the sticker thing, didn't they? Ultimate Team. I mean, I was genius over thought of that. Oh, it's like. 
you've, you've still got to have the, pre, the real people there. Oh, diced. Nice apple, mate. Where'd you get it? <laughs> yeah, I, I do love that, Eloise, when they, when they think of these insane stats. They're like, Tampa Bay have never lost when... <laughs> when they're up by three points in the second quarter at home. <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> um, because it was dead, Dimmy. And players dying is not good. And I'm 1 0 up, so the game is over now, right? Like, the game is over in terms of removals. Um, there's only. There's only another half. Like, if, I'm not, if I, I can't power up, I'll badly hurt. I can't power up or badly hurt now, can I? I could power up or KO. And you just have a mighty blow, so maybe you'll KO somebody. But you know, limited use of the apple in the second half. And it's a dead player, I don't want players to die, particularly. I don't particularly want my players to die. And he okay he's not a he's not a good player, in fact he's a terrible player. But I'm already got two loners. I just don't have. Th I mean, I'm gonna have three loners next match. I really don't want all my team to be fucking loners because they keep dying constantly. I know that's a weird thing to think, but there you go. We might try to score quickly here, might we? No, I can't defend properly. Let's do it. I mean, he is, but it's just a mighty blow catcher. It's not the end of the world, is it? And then the fact he's got to power him, and then he's got to cast him, and then it's got to be a death. And the apple was a death anyway, so it failed whatever it was. So, like, you know, it doesn't matter to it. I've never enjoyed hockey, Helen. Either. Yeah, Kaylon, it's hilarious. I love, I love all the qualifiers. The qualifiers in the NFL stats are amazing. Completely amazing. If only had diving catch. Maybe maybe High Elf should have diving catch, eh, eh Dio? Oh, Manzella West, let's fucking go. What would happen if I blitz and I had diving catch and we both had diving catch? Would it cancel? I've got no idea. Frosty. Yeah, like, I don't know, hockey, like, you know, people people who, who enjoy it are like, oh, it's the best sport, it's all action, it's amazing, it's blah, 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 and I watch it and I just think, it's just a bunch of tickets skating around. <laughs> and, like, I've got, I've got zero interest in what's going on. <laughs> you jack each other off and the first and not loses their diamond cat. <laughs> Hello, help. 
<laughs> Good play by Fanjo here, realises that he's got to move back, otherwise things could get bad for him. Help me, in my humble opinion, one of the <laughs> best commentators that I've ever heard in my life. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's true, Skuro. That is true. Maybe that's it then. Maybe. Oh, you mother flipper. Diced. He hits the smooth one in six. Um, yeah, but that's true, Skuro. Holy shit, that's so true. Should have done your other hit first, mate. <laughs> yeah, that's true. To be fair, that, n now that you mention it, every time I've heard... Um, I heard it mentioned. That's why. Rather, that's been the uh, circumstance. I mean, this is the threat, isn't it? The arch four here. I want to get him away. I want to get him off. I also want to power this guy and get pressure to him. Didn't power him. So I guess it's just max blocks then. Looks like he took his head off. <laughs> Amazing. That was a good turn. <laughs> oh my god, Jeff. <laughs> Yeah, I see what you're saying, Stradik. I mean, that's one of the things about football, isn't it? When like someone does a thirty-yard screamer or whatever, like it's a, it's a beautiful moment. <laughs> you know, like Zidane, Zidane's goal in the, uh, in the Champions League final. You know, Ronaldo's one in the UEFA Cup final. Ronaldo's one versus, uh, can't remember who it was against now. It's one that he did for. Uh, Barcelona. Maradona's second against England. Things like that. Gazers. Like those goals people will remember forever, won't they? Whereas So that could have been a power apple. But it's a loner, so it's still that's even that's a bit of a rubbish one. To apple. Yeah, but like but they're, they're beautiful moments, though, aren't they? Like, the goal is actually... The goals are beautiful, whereas, yeah, I guess I guess if hockey doesn't have... If hockey doesn't have those beautiful goals, then that's a big mark against it, isn't it? Like, there's cool NFL touchdowns, but they're not, like, beautiful like football, are they? <laughs> I 
Oh, yeah, I remember Bills one, yeah. Bills was, was fucking good, wasn't it? We've got the hit on the ball here. I think I take it. Just because the potential payoff is just too big, isn't it? And he's already pretty much locked down here. So his play is to dodge through and pass it to this guy, I guess. Possibly this guy. And he could blitz him off and then pass it to this guy. It's going to be one of these two. That gets him further over to come back down here if I have to. Yeah, I mean, there's you know, don't get me wrong. There's like there's memorable moments, obviously, in in every sport, and there's like, you know, there's a. Uh, yeah, I think soccer is soccer. God damn you, Skuro. Like football goals are just more beautiful than like, you know, like. I guess you could you could argue like you know Brady throwing it is beautiful, but I don't know. Yeah, maybe. It's, I just think it's more beautiful, isn't it? It is called the beautiful game, and it kind of is. But yeah, I'd say yeah, more spectacular in, in NFL. Yeah. He's not going to pass it. Interesting. Oh yeah, because he's got the free. Yeah, he's got two free players, hasn't he? And one basically free. Okay, so the good thing is that at least he hasn't broken away. So I was kind of scared of the breakaway. At least the breakaway hasn't happened. So now the ball's near other players, so it's kind of easier to pressure cautiously. So he may have, like, although this is a good turn, it may have cost him in a few more turns right now. Maybe it's just the, I was, so he's making the breakaway anyway. Okay, well this guy's getting blitzed and everyone else is getting based. High elves are very meh, yes. Yes, they are. Can we hit the ball here? Maybe. Oof, what a scumbag. I don't know how many players I need. Uh, one, two. Three. It's actually quite doable, isn't it? If 
fill, fill in two and then make the hit with can't make the hit on the ball the problem is that so I can chain him to there then chain him to there and then hit him and then get the hit on the ball but the problem is I don't get tackle on it and if it if I fail he's got the outlet hasn't he Let's just cast. Let's just cast him. <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, prick. Tricky, isn't it? This is tricky. Don't want to let him off the hook. <laughs> yeah, I should have done J5. Like, I thought it was a nice chain if it worked, right? If if I'd had the tackler, like, here or something, you know, like, if the tackler was here, then I think it's worth it, but... With not being able to hit him with tackle, and with even having to GFI to hit him with a mighty blow. Ooh! A lovely one! Good thing is he's still not going to get in scoring range this turn. We just have to protect against the breakaway. This guarder is in a shit spot, isn't he? And he's only moved five. Beasting him with a mighty blow, love to see. Hmm. 
Minus move. Oh, he's on no rerolls. Maybe I should have based that line on. But then I quite like cutting off this route out over here. Even though it's too hip towards him, but never mind. He's in a bit of a pickle. This tag is the tackler, but I've still got the wrestler. Hmm. He's done the old don't fail any dice roll strategy, which is a pretty good one. Makes two three pluses to tag the two main threats. Could hit him and get an assist and then make a dodge for a three D. That might be the best way. This gives us two chances to catch the scatter as well, or three. Mm -hmm. assist and you can get so you can assist here and get a 2d how does he get the assist here while leaping so pretty easy if I dodge I give him an even easier hit so I can't dodge Seven seven. He's got to roll dice at least. Oh, hey, 
No, it's not been going, it's basically cancelled. <laughs> So am I. Because Skuro and I are just disillusioned with it, mostly. But yeah, the servers are being down and stuff. As well. Oh my god, I've absolutely diced the pants off him. Just quietly. Oh no, I did it wrong. I honestly just might need a, a week off, which I know sounds stupid after not streaming a lot this month, but um, What is this? <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> Absolutely annihilating his team. What on earth? I know Kalon, but I've got to do. I've got to do. I've got to do. I've got to do six hours a day for nine days to get my ad incentive. So I literally have to. I have to carry on for the next nine days, and after that, I might have a bit of a break. Might have a bit of a break for like about a week. I'll see. <laughs> Game of vision. Um, I mean, the best way to tell them they're completely wrong, or prove to them they're completely wrong, is just ignore them because you can't. You literally can't. If somebody wants to learn or whatever, 
or you know is open to something then fair enough but if they're not then not and no amount of logic or trying to good intentions or anything will help somebody simple as that you just can't it's just no point people don't want the truth <laughs> of course it's another cat <laughs> <laughs> Why wouldn't it be another cars? <laughs> Seven cars. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, it was just it was insane. <laughs> <laughs> that was more like two, I mean that was a that was a lucky as foot game for like two thousand four hundred chaffs. Never mind four hundred two four two point four chaffs. I wouldn't expect to do that much. That was insane. Like just an absolute. I mean that is a comedy mega. Catcher gets the MVP as well. Puts on fifty. Nice. Thirty one blocks. One kill and seven cats. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that is really crazy, isn't it? That is really crazy. It's all the rest of the dice. Don't matter, do they, when, when you do that? When nearly every armor break you make is a Kaz. And of course the apple failed. Oh. On the dead rookie, which is, of course, as bamboozled Dimmy, are playing a dead rookie, but just literally wanted players because it's just so annoying not having players, right? But never mind. 861, glorious. Uh, GG, Fanjo. It's funny, isn't it? Because Fanjo there, I was totally, I was really, really, you know, Fanjo's good at Blood Bowl. And I was thinking I've got to be more conservative versus all the bad players, but then I was most conservative versus probably the best coach this team's played. But then was in a very strong position on the field and didn't want to let that slip to like bad dice or whatever, like a crazy play. And like obviously he was going to find the crazy player to break away. So I felt like I played quite well in shutting it down when he had minimal chances there. Which you see a lot of people let those matches slip, don't you? Because they get overconfident or whatever and let the guard down. So I think I did a good job there. Right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.